don't remember. So, oh, Mr. Mr. Plow, that's my that's name. My name. name again, name again is, is Mr. Plow. Plow. This is the Mr. Plow um, monster truck. <laughs> and it's got a plow. We put a plow on the front of the monster truck. So, we've converted it into a Mr. Plow monster truck that's ready to plow your driveway. So that's pretty cool. The maker of this is you. My nice assistant has made this. He was playing around with the monster truck and wanted to add a plow on the front of it and just figured it out and then added a couple more features. What features did you add? Well, the plow itself is spring loaded or suspension bearing. So it's always as close as to the ground as possible. So do, no matter what object you go over, it's going to go back down and go over that obstacle and then go right back down on the to the ground, huh? Yeah. Because of that suspension system that you put into there, huh? So as you can see here, it's a double arm. So there's two arms, or there's actually four arms, you can see. Uh, just set up based on pins and studs, and then we added the plow to the front and now you have a pit, um, spring operated plow that drives itself to the ground and so why'd you put some wheels on the ends well it was getting stuck on carpet and whatnot. so it was getting stuck on carpet so you wanted to put the wheels on the sides so it would go across the carpet really nice but even without the wheels if we take the wheels off and on this very clean surface we can get it moving forward and plowing all the snow off of our table huh whoa <laughs> so there you go so if you look there's um a couple points here that we tied into and then if you look at the back of the plow we took the plow out plow off so that you can see the mechanisms. So we got a couple links here, okay? And then that's tied together with this blue part. And then the spring is tying everything together. So th that shows you how that one arm works. And then we have a second arm doing the exact same thing, just on the other side. It's falling off a bit. No, yeah, it's fine. So that's the mechanism of the hinge for the plow. So then all you have to do is mount that to the monster truck or whatever other truck you got. And uh, you can create your own Mr. Plow Lego truck. That's pretty cool. Thank you, assistant, for making this. This is a really cool build. So if you wanted to see how we built the monster truck, we actually have a speed build of this um, designed back when you were a little yeah. kid, huh? So maybe we'll do an updated version of that, another speed build of the monster truck itself. It's a really cool Technic kit. Um, one of the coolest, it comes with the three different motors, one for steering in the middle that drives um, the wheels. It's four-wheel steering and four-wheel drive because there's an independent motor on each side, kind of like a Tesla. It's got a Ford um, motor for the front wheels and an aft motor for the rear, rear wheels. And then, but the cool thing is, is it has this uh, four wheel steering as well, which is very cool. It drives over anything, huh? Yeah. I mean, you can use this to drive over your books, uh, your book bag, your little, your little sister, whatever you want to drive over, huh? So now we got the plow on the front and it's spring loaded so we can go plow some snow. Yeah. But in South Carolina, we don't have much snow, huh? Yeah. We had snow a couple days ago, and uh, that was fun. We should have got this out and took yeah. a, plowed some snow, huh? Yeah. So. Although Legos don't plow very well. Well, Legos don't get wet very well. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, South Carolina snow is more wet than it is fluffy. So, there you go. This is the Mr. Plow Monster Truck ready to go into the Simpsons world and plow some Simpsons driveways. What do you think?
That looks good. I think it looks awesome. Thanks everybody for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye bye. Mr. Plow. That, my name is Mr. Plow. Don't remember. Oh, Mr. Plow. That's my name. That name again is Mr. Plow. <laughs>